Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. So today in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how do you delete Microsoft Loop account. So let's get into the video. So as, as you might have known that Microsoft Loop actually uses your Microsoft account in order to log into the Loop application, right? So if you wanna close your Microsoft Loop account then or close or delete your Microsoft Loop account, then you can only do so by uh, by closing your Microsoft account. So if you close your Microsoft account, that will also close your Loop account. So how do you close your Microsoft accounts? So I will show you now, right now. So open up your browser or Google, and then just search for close Microsoft account, and then simply click on this Microsoft uh, uh, option uh, link here, close your Outlook account. So just click on it. And then what we're gonna do, we're gonna start the process, click on close your account, and then We'll start the process. So now, what are you going to do? We're going to sign in to the uh, sign in to the uh, uh, to your Microsoft account. So type in the password of your Microsoft account. Okay. So type in. Uh, it didn't ask for my Microsoft. Just uh, just want to make a point here. It's it's asking for my password. It didn't ask for my uh, Microsoft ID because I've I'm already logged in. So I've already logged into my Loop account here. So as you can see, this is my loop, account, loop ID, my Microsoft ID. I've already logged in. So that's why it, it's asking for my password straight away. So you might have to, uh, if you're not logged in, you might have to enter your ID and then password, all right? So click on sign in and then next. All right, so once you enter the password, it will log into your account. Then once you're on your account, click on your name to, to get into your account and then click on close account here. So once you click on your close account, then you'll get to this page here and then scroll down and proceed to close your account. And then it's going to ask you for your password again. So just type in password. All right. So then what I'm going to do, click on continue. Once you click on continue, so it's going to ask you for some general information about closing information. So try to read it. And then once you're done, click on hit on next. And then what you're going to do, you're going to tick in all these boxes here. So just you're agreeing to their terms for closing. So type all that in, I mean, tick that all. Okay, and then select the reason. Um, um, reason for your closure so just choose any and then click on mark account for closure all right and then we are almost there so it was almost done so once you're done and then here that's it my account will be closed from effective from this day onwards then hit on done and that's it since i've closed my microsoft account i will i will i will also so that will also close my associated microsoft loop account so that's pretty much it is hope this video is helpful i will see you all in another video thank